Now, moving on to Ghana. An integrated tree planting technology known as Growasis Waterbox is changing the landscape in Mafia and Foe in the Volta region. Yes, the technology will not only fix the climate through afforestation, but also improve food production and create jobs. Here is more on that story. In Mafia and Foe, Volta region, Ghana. The tree cutting narrative is changing. As we are cutting all trees, one day, one day, one day, it will definitely affect us. It is trees that give us the, uh, the, the air that we breathe. And uh, if you continue cutting it, uh, one day we will, we will not sustain ourselves. For years now, residents in Mafia and Foe have been cutting down trees for different reasons. Some farmers in Ghana clear up forests to get land for farming cocoa, the country's main cash crop. Others cut trees for export, while a majority use trees as a source of food, firewood, and for building. According to the Food and Agriculture Organization of the United Nations, Ghana's closed forests depreciates at the rate of 182,000 hectares per five years. The open forests depreciates at the rate of 45,000 hectares per annum. However, the community is now filling up the deforested patches of land. Their target is to cover 5,000 acres of land with trees. To do so, they have embraced the grass's water box technology, an integrated watering skill that can sustain trees in dry, eroded deserts and rocky areas in all climatic conditions. You, you first remove the top, then uh, this one covers the water. Uh, first, this is the whole water box. This contains five liters of water. And the water is connected through this rope to the tree. And the water will be dropping one by one to the root of the tree. So when you pour the five liters of water over here, you have to cover it with this black uh, uh, cover to protect uh, already water pour over here so that the rainwater will not de disturb it. Then we we'll have uh, another cover because the, there must be air to uh, maybe prevent uh, odors and other this is, uh, uh, in the water. So you, this, this uh, uh, tube will, will, will send in uh, air into the water. So as time goes on, you have to remove this and see whether the dropping of the water uh, rain will disturb the other one over there. The technology is the first of its kind in sub-Saharan Africa. The water can sustain a tree or a plant for one and a half years. Once the plant is strong enough to grow on its own, the water box is removed and used again up to around 10 times. Compared to other watering techniques, this water-saving technology cocoon costs about two and a half dollars per year per plant. So far, Ghana has 650 boxes to support afforestation in Mafianfoy. We are appealing to the whole Africa. Let us all get involved so that we we'll stop cutting the trees, uh, we we'll stop destroying our forestries, uh, so that the, we can we can live for 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 a long time. One water box costs around twelve dollars and fifty cents and can be purchased online. Ghana's Adidome Farm Institute over the past months has been observing plants and crops planted with Groas's water box and those dependent on watering from farmers. We are using it to establish uh, economic crops like mango, like um, 
guava, like cocoa, we'll visit the site and see. So we are testing the, the water box on it. The area will be used as a forest. At the same time, we are going to get food. Over the years, the residents have been volunteering to work on the farms in Mafianfoy. The reward will be the results of the trees they have planted. Uh, an initiative also, that is the association. Time for a short break now, but stick around, we will be back with this and more. I wanted to make something good out of something that is considered harmful. We find out why this Egyptian artist is lighting up his portraits. <laughs> 